Hi guys, this is Creative Graphics. Welcome to another episode of my design tutorial. So in this tutorial, I'm going to be designing a social media flyer, which is all about um, Valentine holiday. So I'm going to be using my square size. So I'm going to be using square size in this design. So the first thing is I'm going to be using these resources. The travel flyer. I'm going to be using these resources. So this is the image of the of the destinations the holiday is going to take place. The kind of Victoria the image. So I'm going to create a solid color. I'm going to click this. Click any of this. Um, this side of the image. I don't want to use blue. I don't want to use blue. So this is okay. For me. Now mask this and delete some parts. So my brush, my laser is 900. I need to delete some parts. As you blend this way. You see. So this background actually blend with this face. This is actually what I want. Another one is to create another gradient again. Just white gradient. White gradient. So this place will be white, but the opacity should be 100, and the other side should be zero. So if you want to drag it, just make sure it's at this gradient. Drag it up, down. And this is fine. So let's begin to add our text. So we call it um, a Valentine holiday. That should be the headline. So Valentine holiday. So this should be the center. Like this. And center like this. So I'm going to add some beautiful glyphs to this. We go to window glyphs. So I'm going to add some clips. So I'm going to use this for the B and the Y also. I'm going to check it for Y. I'm going to use this for the Y. So the color code. I'm going to check the color code. So the color code I'm going to be using is FB3. FB3. For a two, it's not too red because Valentine is summer red, but I'm not going to use that bright red. So another thing is to add gradients to this um, color. So I'm going to add gradient, go to blend option, I'm going to gradient. I'm going to use this gradient. What is the name? 5x3. Let's look for 5x3. And click OK. To multiply, blend option should be multiply. 23 opacity. So scale should be 136. And click OK. The another thing is, so the destination is, is Zanzibar. Zanzibar is in Tanzania. In Tanzania. So this color, just copy it. Ctrl C. So click the shape. Ctrl C. So we copy this gradient again. Copy layer style. Paste layer style. So you can just come to this gradient and, and increase increase the scale. So let's increase the scale. Or probably can delete some parts. Let's delete this side. I want the color to be blue. And 
Eu não entendi isso. Se der C, Trip, Tu, Sans, So this, I'm going to change the script font. I'm going to use this called Sovent Atrius. To make it white. To make it white. And bring it to this. To this box. And increase the tracking. To make sure that. Use this to make sure that it. So social media design is always short and very very precise. So, so I'm going to add some some elements just to bring the design to life. So this is first thing is to add this um petal love ship. So another one is to add some shapes from vector shape. I'll go to this box, this rectangular to key custom shape and look for look for the love shape this art shape look for this art shape so i'll move this red this time around make this red and just rotate this a little I think this is fine. So treat to Zanzibar and the rest. So let's add um, the package you're going to enjoy once you travel. So I'm going to copy this. Copy this. And paste it here. I'm going to paste it. So I'm going to use I'm not going to use red black. I'm not going to I'm going to use this 3F, 3F, 3F. It's not really black. So I'm going to use a font called Oswald. Oswald Lights. Let's make this 5. So I'm going to increase the tracking to let me make it nice, nice perfect. So once you travel, once you have an early travel to Zanzibar, you enjoy all these packages. So let's talk about the cost of action, which is the price. So I'm going to do something like this. I'm going to do something like this. I'm going to draw a rectangle like this. So I'm going to fill this with so let's check color here. Yeah? I'm going to use this FDB 7 BB for the first one. I'm going to duplicate it and bring it up here. Bring it up and copy this color. Copy this color. Copy. Copy and paste. Oh, it's fine. So we are going to add gradient to this soup, but let's do the blend option. Gradient overlay. Gradient overlay. So I'm going to delete this. Make this zero. 
delete this. I'm going to delete this. So I'm going to use only this side. So I'm just going to make it. Let's reverse it. Let's make it come from this side a little. Come from this side a little. I think this is fine. So I'm going to make it. Let's turn it. Okay, so just coming from this angle, I think this is fine. So make it 61, 150 scale, 48 opacity multiply. So this is fine. So we're going to begin again on the J and bring it like this. So you bring it under it. So clear clear style. We're going to do something like this, control C. Right click, skill, and bring it down. Bring it down. So control T again. Just, just so make this a little bit deep red. 821 C25. This is fine. So this is fine. So I'm going to close like this. So let's see. Let's see the price or the amount for the trip is going to be. Let's see the first one should be two. Ctrl G. So just duplicate it and bring it down. Let's say for another person. Let's say for So let's input the logo. This is the logo. So this is the logo. So this is just a random logo. Stock logo and logo. We travel um travel agent. So let me skew this or or warp. I'll make this twenty or fifteen. And this is fine. We we'll try this stuff. So this is travel you can just add this to J bring it here. Delete this. Alright. Try this. 
So, I want to skew this. Ctrl C, right click and skew. I read this up like this. I read this up like this. And this is fine. I do that to make sure that it's center. This is fine. So let's add the last thing. Is this better? I'm going to distribute this better. Ctrl T horizontal. Ctrl T again. Vertical. Ctrl T horizontal. So I'm going to use this side first. to bring the design to life so I'm going to mask this and delete like two out of this razor I'm going to use block and delete this and also delete this and this is fine. And this is fine like this. I want to make a make a duplicate. Bring it to this side like this. So I'm going to blow it. Total blow motion blow. Click OK. So in this motion block, I'm going to click this box. Click this box and bring some to life. I'll click my brush. So click the eraser, I click the block. So I want to click erase the motion block. Let's do like two from motion block. Let's make two from motion block. So this, let me erase it. So this is the final design. So let me adjust this. This is center like this. So this is the final design. So let me know what you think in the comment section.